Hi guys, Margarita from Kick for Fit is here and today we're gonna do a total body, body weight, 30 minutes workout. So we're not gonna need any dumbbells or any other equipment, so just yourself and have some water, maybe mat, yoga mat, and that's all. So we have just, uh, we have 12 different exercises. We're gonna repeat them three times, 30 seconds each move, and we are good to go. For the beginning, we'll need to warm up. Let's go. Marsh, marsh, marsh. As always, we start our workouts with a warm up. Marching, slowly we increase the intensity. There we go. If you need to go slower, go slower. Marsh. Here we go. We have five, four, three, two, and one. We're gonna add the step. Step side to side. Use your arms. Go slow if you need. Here we go. Nice. Breathe. Open your body. Close your body if you need. You can go a little bit faster. Or if you need, you can go slower if it's too much. Nice. Give me three. And two. And one. Nice. Next. We're going to add one more step. Step to side to side. Use your arms nice. We have five, four, three, and two, and one. Use your arms, reach all the way up, all the way up. Step back, reach up, reach up. Nice. We have five, four, three, two. And one, warm up your shoulders, circles, all the way back. Give me three, two, and one. Let's go forward. We have four, three, two, and one. Nice. Open your body, step, open, open. Move your leg blades all the way back. We have three, and two, and one. Let's warm up your legs. Stepping back, but not too low. Exhale, reach forward. Nice. We have five, four, three, two, and one. Nice. Opposite heel, opposite hand, tap. Exhale, leaning forward, crunching forward, warming up your core. In your glutes, in your back. Nice, you have four, three, and two, and one. Make the lock in front of you and rotate. Exhale and pivot, squeezing the glutes every time you rotate. Good job. You have three, and two, and one. Nice. You let some cardio. You run side to side, side to side. If you want, you can just do light jogging without jumping side to side. Head bounced. Yep, go ahead. Keep going. We have five, four, three, two, and one. Nice. We're gonna add the kicks. That's the warm up for your legs, for your back, and your core. Good job. Exhale, when you drop your arms. If you want, you can go faster. Beginners, don't go too high. You have four, three, two, and one. Nice, let's warm up your little back, your quads. We're gonna lean forward, you cross your arms. Get up, inhale. Inhale, moving your tail all the back. Nice, we have five, four, three, and two, and one. Nice, let's add the squat. You go all the way back. Don't forget the way we do that. Tail all the way back, knees on top of your feet. Every time, I keep repeating the same, just for you to remember, not to forget. Nice, down. Exhale when you go down, knees. We don't bring them inside, outside. Nice. 
Give me three. And two. And one. Nice. Bring your feet together. Give me some circles. Circles with your knees. Nice. Give me three. Two. One. Change direction. Nice. We have three. And two. And one. Wider stance. Lean forward. Extend your arms with another T. Side to side. Okay, warming up your back. We have four, three, two, and one. Nice. Let's warm up your legs, your inner thighs. Move your tail back just like for the squat. And up and down. Exhale and you go down. Nice. You have five, four, three, two, and one. Nice. Excellent. Hip rotators. Big circles. With your legs, let's go. You have five, four, three, two, and one. Let's go for the circle inside. Inward, let's go. It's a little bit awkward, but still it helps to warm up your, your legs. You're gonna do lots of exercises today for your legs. Three, two, and one. Nice. Excellent. Some more rotation. We're not moving your low part of your body. Keep it stable. Glutes inside. Knees are soft. Rotate. Rotate. Nice. We have five, four, three, two, and one. Big circles with your arms. Here we go. We have five, four, three, and two, and one. Nice. And we are good to go. Are you ready? Let's do it. So as I said, we have 12 exercises, 30 seconds for each move. We repeat them three times. Are you ready? Let's go. Number one is going to be just regular jumping jacks. That's for advanced beginners. What you do, you just step, exhale, when you lift your arms up. Are you ready? 30 seconds. Let's go. You just jump, jump, jump. You can go slower if you need. Beginner step. Big step. Exhale every time you extend your arms. Nice. 10 more seconds. Keep going. We have five, four, three, two, and one. Second move. Right away. We go for the prisoner squat. Knees looking outside. Step. Get up, keep your hands behind your head, let's go. Down, and up, and down, and up. Excellent, keep your back straight. Exhale when you go down. Nice, we have five, four, three, two, and one. Have some rest. Next move, we go for four hooks, pivot in your body. And two jumps in out. So one, two, three, four, in out, in out. Again, one, two, three, four, in out, in out. Keep going. Beginners, no jumping. One, two, three, four, step, step. Okay, let's go. We have eight seconds. In out, in out. Exhale, when you punch, in, out, in, out. Woo. Have some rest. Next move. You're going for the curtsy. Have a look. Same leg, curtsy, and then move your leg up. Same side, all the way down, all the way up with your leg. Okay? Advance, don't do the pose. Just lift it up right away. Down and up. Watch your knee, should be right on top of your foot. Let's go. Down. Down. And up. Beginners, don't go too low. Step up. It's a really good exercise for your glute. The glute muscles, they're suffering right now. And the outside part of your leg. We have five, four, three, two, and one. Shake your legs. And we're gonna engage the other leg. Same thing, just for the other leg. Let's go. Down, step, 
up. If it's too hard, beginners, just don't lift your leg too high, all right? Or you can bend your knee. You just, just lift your knee if it's too hard. And don't go low for the curtsy. Exhale twice when you go down and when you go up. Two and one. Shake your legs and you're going on the floor. So next exercise is going to be the push-ups. Regular one, we know this move. Knees on the floor, bring your butt low, check the position for your thumbs. They should be right under your armpits. So what you do, you just go as low as you can, down with the beginners, just don't go too low. Advanced all the way down. Ready? Let's go. Exhale, when you go down, advance. If it's easy, give me the full push-up. Extend your legs, keep them off the ground. Nice, keep going. Exhale, beginners, don't keep your butt up, bring it low, right, make your body straight, give me five more seconds, nice, five, four, three, two, and one, good job, Ooh, shake your arms, have some rest, next is exercise, gonna be the kick, all the way back, and then bring your knee to your side, try to reach your elbow, if you can't reach, it's all good, kick it back, Inhale, kick it back, exhale, same leg. Ready, let's go. In, up. Again, really good exercise for your glutes, for your side muscles, for your obliques. Nice. Just kick it back. Imagine you need to kick away something heavy. We got five, four, three, two, and one, nice. Next move, we're laying down, before we switch to the other leg, we're laying down to the plank position, have a look. So we go up to the plank, then we lay down, lift the legs and arms. Up to your plank position, extend your legs and arms. Beginners, up to your knees, keep your butt low, and then extension, let's go. Open your legs and arms, on your knees. Again, open it up, on your knees. You don't leave the butt. Too high. Keep going. If it's too much to leave the legs and arms at the same time, then just opposite leg, opposite arm. Let's go. We have five, four, three, two, and one. Nice. Now you're gonna work on the other side. Same thing. Kick it back. Stand on your knees. Hands right under your shoulders. Kick it back, knee to your side, extension, let's go. Knee to your side, extend it back. Nice. Here you go, don't forget to breathe. We're reaching your arm if we can. If we, if we can, it's all good. Nice, we have five, four, three, and two, and one. Let's go on your back. Next exercise is the bicycle. The advanced. We're not reaching the floor with your heels, right? We just rotate the body, reaching the opposite knee with the opposite elbow. Beginners, knees on the floor. We just crunch in, trying to reach opposite knee. Let's go. Beginners, if it's too hard, so what you can do, just hold your upper body up, Knees up, exhale, that's all you do, just make sure you keep your upper body up, chin, look it up, nice, keep going, we have 10 more seconds, we have 5, 4, 3, and 2, and 1, amazing job, next one, we're going to lay on your side, lay on your side, so what you do, we're going to work on the inner thigh of your leg, so keep your Elbows right under your shoulder, so rotate your palm, your leg inside your foot, and you just lift it up, up, up. Try not to reach the floor. If it's too hard, sure, you can put it down and then try to lift it as high as you can. Exhale, exhale, keep going. Nice. We have six, five, four, three two 
and one. Really good exercise, I bet you could feel it inside your legs, right? Next, before we switch to the other side, we're gonna work on the scissors, we're gonna open your legs. Point your toes, exhale and open it, let's go, let's go. Nice, if you're too tired at some point, guys, you can just pause the video and keep, keep going again after you have some rest. Keep going, we have seven, six, five, four. If it's too much on your neck, just put it down. Put down your head, three, two, and one. Nice. Let's go on the other side. That's the last exercise in the set. So what do you do? Again, cross your feet and let's go. Keep your foot flexed. We go up, up. If it's uncomfortable for you guys to hold it this way, just, you know what? Don't cross your legs. Keep your leg outside. Keep going. Nice. Up, up. Keep your foot flexed. Your heel goes all the way up. Good job, we have seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Whew. So have some water if you need. You finished one set, so we're gonna repeat the same set two more times, twice. Okay, have some water, and we're gonna start with jumping jacks in 10 seconds. Shake your legs at once. Try to go a little bit harder, a little bit faster, lower, deeper with the exercises, right? Beginners, just keep the same rhythm. Are you ready? We have three, two, and one. Jumping jacks, so exercise number one. Let's go. Some cardio moves. Beginners, we step and don't forget, no jumping for you. Or if you have issues with your knees, guys, same thing, don't jump, all right? Keep going. Nice, 10 more seconds. We have five, four, three, two, and one. Have some rest. Next one, prisoner squat. Step, all up, you can cross your legs. Advance, go a little bit lower. Beginners, not that low. Ready, let's go. And squat, up. Exhale, when you go down, beginners, just don't go too low, do your best. The idea is, yeah, just to move your tail all the way back without moving your knees forward, right? Keep going, we have five, four, three, two, and one. Have okay, some rest. Next move, you're gonna go for four hooks, do you remember? One, two, three, four, pivoting your body, meaning your punchers, and then two hops, one, two, or two steps, one, two. Ready, let's go. <sighs> Exhale, when you punch, and then in, out, in, out. Again, one, two, three, four. One, two, one, two, keep going. It's a really good exercise for your core, <sighs> for your shoulders, three, four, your legs. Keep going, we have three, two, and one. Good job. Next, we have curtsy. Do you remember? Same leg, curtsy, leg lift to your side. Curtsy, or just the knee. Let's go. Same leg, all the way down. All the way down. Good job. Down. Same leg. Here we go again. Watch your knee. Shouldn't go forward. Right? Keep it right on top of your foot. We have three and two and one. Shake your legs. Same move for the other leg. Get ready. Curtsy. Leg lift. Curtsy. Or just your knee. Let's go. And down. And down. Here we go. Nice. We have just 15 seconds for this move. I bet you start feeling your legs. Whew, 10 more seconds. We have five, four, three, two, 
and one. Excellent. Shake your legs and be going on the floor. Push ups. Here's the next one. Remember how we do that? Yep, that's right. Your knees dance. Wide your shoulders. Hands right under your armpits. And let's go. Push up all the way down, all the way up. If it's too much, just don't go too low. Just keep the position for your body. Keep it low. Because if you do it like that, it's not the same. Believe me. Not the same muscles engaged. Keep going. Nice. We have five, four, three, two, and one. Whew. Next, we have the kickback. Do you remember? So what do you do? Move your knee outside, kick it back, bring your elbow to your arm. Let's go. Kick it outside. Next. We have. If it's too much, guys, you can go all the way back. Still, your glutes are working, just not maybe that much for your side muscles. But still still working. We have six. Five, four, three, and two, and one. Good job. Whew. Laying down, you remember? You have Superman at the plank position. Let's go, beginners, to your knees and up. If it's too hard, you can just hold the plank. Just hold it if it's too much. Sounds good? Let's go. It's your upper back, your core, your legs, advanced full plank, if you can. Keep going, give me 10 more seconds. Five, four, three, two, and one. Good job. Other side for the kick. Get ready. And let go. Kick it back. Knee to your side, outside. Job. Nice. Kick it back. Kick it back. Exhale you when you move it back. Nice. Really good exercise for your legs, for your glutes. 10 more seconds. We got five, four, three, two, and one. Nice. Lay down. Bicycle. Do you remember? That's your core. You all want the belly to be to be flat, right? Let's work it. Let's go, let's go. We rotate. Beginners. Heels on the floor. Just the crunch. Again, if it's too hard, if you have issues with your belly, so what we do? We just bring your knees up. Nice, we have 10 more seconds. Five. Four, three, two, and one. Whew. Excellent. We have a couple more moves. Remember, you're working on your inner thigh. This time, guys, you can lay down on your shoulder, and when you lift your leg, we can add the crunch. Whew. Let's go. If it's too much, guys, you can stay in your elbow and just work on your leg. Just lift it as far as you can advance, try not to touch the floor. Keep going. You crunch it forward. Keep your foot flexed. That helps to engage your inner thighs as much as possible. Give me three and two and one. Nice. Next move. Leg scissors. Do you remember? Lift your legs up. You're gonna open them. Hold your upper body up. Let's go. Point your toes. Hold your upper body up. Keep your hands under your butt. Usually it helps uh, to keep your low back tight to the floor. If it's too much on your neck, as I said, just bring it down. Work with the legs. 10 more seconds. That's five, four, three, two, and one. Amazing. You have the other side. Other side, lay it down. Again, on your shoulder, keep the other leg bent on your knee. Again, crunch. Crunch and reach your foot. If you can't, 
If it's too much, on your elbow. Just tap in your shin. Nice, we have 10 more seconds. We have five, four, three, and two, and one. Whew, have some rest. You'll have to do this the whole set again. Just once again and you'll be done. Have some water. Walk around if you need. We're gonna start in 10 seconds. Sounds good? Breathe if you need. Or you can pause the video if you need more rest. Sounds good? If you're good to go, let's go. Jumping jacks. Last time we did this exercises, so give me your orders. Let's go. Jumping jacks. Just jumps. Beginner step. Step. If you need to go slower, sure. Go slower. Advance. Go harder. It's the last time you would not. Last time you're doing this workout. Come on, 10 seconds. Hopefully not this one God, but yourself. <laughs> you have four, three, and two, and one. Rest. Breeze and squats. Let's go. To remember the move, hold the log behind your head. Step up. Keep your feet looking outside. Let's go. Down. Up. Exhale when you go down. Down. And up. And down. And up. Keep going, beginners, not too low. Just as low as you can. The weight goes between your feet. Yes, we have seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Shake your legs, shake your arms. Next move, four hooks, and then two hooks in out. Ready? Let's go. One, two, three, Four, in, out, in, out. One, two, three, four. In, out, in, out. One, squeeze the glute when you rotate. Three, four, if you need, step, step. One, two, three, four. In, out, in, out. Ten more seconds. Three, four. Last one. One, two, three, four. In, out, in, out. Have some rest. Next, curtsy for the last time. Do you remember? Knee, curtsy, knee up. Three, two, and one. Same leg. Done. And done. Your weight should go on your leading leg. Nice. The other leg goes back just for the balance. 10 more. Nice, we have five, four, three, two, and one. Other side, shake your legs, shake your legs, and let's go. Down, knee, pull the straight leg up to you, whatever you can do. Straight leg is better, but if it's too much, just the knee. Excellent, we have 10 more, 10 more, Whew. but not any, any more, we have 3 more, 2 more, and 1, done, done here, we're going down for push-ups, get ready, 3, 2, and 1, let's go, from your knees, push-up, so your chest muscles, your core, Keep going. Nice. Keep going, beginners. Not too low. If that's too much, that's an option for you to do. If it's really, really hard, you can do that. Three, two, and one. Kick it back. Do you remember what we do? Kick it back. Engage and work in your glutes. Let's go. Kick it back. Advance. Want to make it harder? You can go for the full plank. Keep working. We have 15 seconds. We have 12. We have 10. Kick it back. We have three and two and one. Excellent. Plank. Remember, 
Get it up from the plank to the plank position. Down, lift your legs and arms. Up, down. Beginners from your knees. Here you go. We don't lift your butt. We just lift your upper body, your shoulders, in your upper back. Keep going. Nice. You have eight seconds. If it's too much, just hold it. Three, two, and one. Excellent. Other leg. Kick it back. Let's go. Kick it back. Kick it back. We work on different muscle groups. That's why you try to have as least break between the exercise as possible. But as I said, if you need, slow down. Go slower or have more rest. Keep going. Next nice. we have three and two and one. Amazing. On your back. Just a few exercises left, guys. Let's go. Bicycle. You can extend your legs. You're gonna make it even harder. Extend your arms. Or just the regular bicycle. Beginners. What you were doing with you? Do you remember? Crunch into your opposite knee with the opposite elbow. Keep going. We have zero seconds. Good job. Let's go on your side. Here, do you remember? We lay down on your shoulder, on your hip. We're gonna crunch towards your leg. Keep your foot flex inside. Flex inside. Let's go. So it's your core, it's your obliques. If it's too hard to go all the way up, you can just do a little crunch. Little crunch. If it's too much, from your shoulder. We have five, four, three, and two, and one. Lay down on your back. Whew, relax a little bit. Two more moves. Hold your upper body up if you can. And you're opening your legs, working on your inner thighs. It's a really good exercise for toning your legs, your inner muscles. Keep going. Keep your feet, your toes pointed. You have seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Last exercise. We're going down the side. Again, on your shoulder, or on your elbow, up to you. Yeah, let's go. Crunch it up. Foot is flexed. If it's too much, on your elbow. Leave your leg, advance. We're not touching the floor, don't forget. Nice, keep going. You have seven, six, five, four, three, two and one and we're done here we go our workout is over you boosted your metabolism you work on your body on your muscles you got stronger you lost lots of calories good job now we'll need to stretch open your arms bring them back 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 squeezing your leg please leg blades hold it Reach all the way outside, stretching your obliques. Reach, reach, reach. Then try to reach a little bit forward in front of you. Side in front. Three, two, and one. Other side. Reach all the way outside. Hold it. Three, two, one. And a little bit forward. Three, two, and one. Good job. Excellent. Let's extend the legs. Let's go for the five. Lift your butt up. So now you're gonna try to reach the floor with the opposite heel, this alternating heel. Bend in one elbow, one knee, and then the other one. Here we go. We're stretching your calves. We have three and two and one. Let's go on your knees. Let's go for cobra stretch. Keep your chin up. Stretch on your abs. Chin up, up, up. We can exhale, rotate, look back one side, hold it. Two, and one, and then the other side. Nice. 
three, two, and one. Whew. Let's relax your back with your fingers. Try to reach as far as you can. Far, far, far. And then let's roll it up. Nice. Let's get up slowly. Let's get up. Let's grab your ankle. Push. Push on it. Stretch your quads. Elbows back. Don't push too hard. No pain. Nice. Give me three, two, and one. Nice. Other leg. Grab it and pull. We have three, two, and one. Let's stretch your inner thighs. I know I work on them today. So let's open your legs. Feet looking outside. Outside. Let's lean forward. Bring your hands on the floor. And hold it. Stay as low as you can. As low as you can. Hold it. We can even place one of your hands in front of you. Other one a little bit at the back. And we can move forward and back. Bring it away to one hand and then the other one. To we'll give even deeper stretch. Right? Give it three. And two. And one. Nice. Feet together. Feet together. Make the lock behind your knees, under your knees, and roll your back up. Exhale. One, two. Relax. And then again, pull yourself up. One, two. Good job. And the last one. One, and two. Good job. Slowly begin it up. Reach all the way up, all the way down. Relax, couple more. One. And last one. Up and heel. Exhale, good job. And we are done for today. Thank you for joining me. If you like the video, please give me your thumb up. Subscribe to my channel. 